The world is full of amazing places that showcase the natural and cultural diversity and beauty of our planet. Some of these places are so exceptional and outstanding that they have been designated as UNESCO World Heritage Sites, which means that they have a universal value and significance for humanity, and that they need to be protected and preserved for future generations. In this video, we will highlight 20 of the UNESCO World Heritage Sites that you can visit, from the coral reefs of Australia to the volcanic islands of Chile. These sites are not ranked in any particular order, as they all have something unique and special to offer. Number 20. Great Barrier Reef, Australia, is the largest and most diverse coral reef system in the world, stretching over 2,300 kilometers along the coast of Queensland, Australia. It is home to thousands of species of marine life, including fish, turtles, sharks, whales, and dolphins, as well as hundreds of islands and caves, some of which are inhabited by humans. You can visit the reef by taking a boat, a plane, or a helicopter and enjoy the views of the turquoise water, the coral formations, and the marine animals. You can also snorkel, dive, or swim in the reef and experience the underwater wonderland. Number 19. Taj Mahal, India. The Taj Mahal is a mausoleum and a symbol of love built by the Mughal Emperor Shah Jahan in the 17th century in memory of his beloved wife, Mumtaz Mahal, who died in childbirth. It is located in the city of Agra, India, and is considered one of the most beautiful and elegant buildings in the world, with its white marble dome, minarets, and gardens. You can visit the Taj Mahal by taking a train, a bus, or a car, and admire the architecture, the craftsmanship, and the history of the monument. You can also see the sunrise or the sunset over the Taj Mahal and witness the changing colors of the marble. Number 18. Machu Picchu, Peru, is an ancient Inca city and a sacred site built in the 15th century on a mountain ridge in the Andes, Peru. It is one of the most mysterious and impressive archaeological sites in the world with its stone buildings, terraces, and temples that blend harmoniously with the natural environment. You can visit Machu Picchu by taking a train, a bus, or a hike, and explore the ruins, the scenery, and the culture of the site. You can also learn about the history, the astronomy, and the religion of the Inca civilization, and marvel at their engineering and artistic skills. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button below. By subscribing, You'll join our global community of travelers and get access to more amazing destinations, tips, and stories. Don't miss this opportunity to discover new places and cultures with Trevelyu. Number 17. Pyramids of Giza, Egypt, are the oldest and the only surviving of the seven wonders of the ancient world, built by the pharaohs of the old kingdom of Egypt between the 26th and the 23rd century BC. They are located in the outskirts of Cairo, Egypt, and are the most iconic and majestic monuments of the ancient Egyptian civilization with their pyramidal shape, size, and alignment. You can visit the Pyramids of Giza by taking a taxi, a bus, or a camel, and see the three main pyramids, the Sphinx, and the Valley Temple. You can also enter the pyramids and see the chambers, the sarcophagi, and the hieroglyphs. Number 16. Grand Canyon National Park, USA. The Grand Canyon National Park is a natural wonder and a geological marvel, carved by the Colorado River over millions of years in the state of Arizona, USA. It is one of the most spectacular and awe-inspiring landscapes in the world, with its colorful rock layers, steep cliffs, and winding river. You can visit the Grand Canyon National Park by taking a car, a bus, or a plane and enjoy the views of the canyon from the South Rim, the North Rim, or the Skywalk. You can also hike, raft, or camp in the canyon and experience the wildlife, the flora, and the culture of the park. Number 17. 
Number 15. Acropolis of Athens, Greece. Of Athens is a hill and a citadel where the ancient Greeks built their most important and magnificent temples and monuments in the 5th century BC. It is located in the center of Athens, Greece, and is the cradle of the Western civilization, democracy, and philosophy with its classical and artistic achievements. You can visit the Acropolis of Athens by taking a metro, a bus, or a walk and see the Parthenon, the Erechtheion, the Propylia, and the Temple of Athena Nike. You can also visit the Acropolis Museum, where you can see the sculptures, the friezes, and the artifacts of the Acropolis. Number 14. Angkor Wat, Cambodia, is a temple and a religious complex built by the Khmer kings in the 12th century in the province of Siem Reap, Cambodia. It is the largest and most impressive religious structure in the world, with its five towers, galleries, and courtyards that represent the Hindu cosmology and mythology. You can visit Angkor Wat by taking a tuk-tuk, a bike, or a car and admire the architecture, the bas-reliefs, and the statues of the temple. You can also visit the other temples and sites of the Angkor Archaeological Park, such as the Angkor Tom, the Top Rome, and the Bayon. Number 13. Great Wall of China, China, is a fortification and a defense system built by various Chinese dynasties and states from the 7th century BC to the 17th century AD along the northern border of China. It is one of the longest and most impressive human-made structures in the world, with its stone, brick, and earth walls, towers, and gates that stretch over 21,000 kilometers. You can visit the Great Wall of China by taking a train, a bus, or a car, and see the different sections of the wall, such as the battling, the Mu Tianyu, and the Jinshanling. You can also walk, climb, or slide on the wall and enjoy the views of the mountains, the valleys, and the villages. Number 12. Galapagos Islands, Ecuador. The Galapagos Islands are a group of volcanic islands and a national park located in the Pacific Ocean about 1,000 kilometers off the coast of Ecuador. They are one of the most unique and diverse ecosystems in the world, with a variety of endemic species of animals and plants, such as the giant tortoises, the marine iguanas, and the Galapagos finches. You can visit the Galapagos Islands by taking a plane, a boat, or a cruise, and see the wildlife, the flora, and the geology of the islands. You can also snorkel, dive, or kayak in the water and see the sea lions, the penguins, and the sharks. Number 11. Petra, Jordan, is an ancient city and a necropolis carved by the Nabataeans in the 4th century BC in the desert of southern Jordan. It is one of the most mysterious and fascinating archaeological sites in the world with its rock-cut tombs, temples, and palaces that display the influences of the Greek, Roman, and Arab cultures. You can visit Petra by taking a bus, a car, or a horse, and enter the city through the Seek, a narrow and winding gorge that leads to the treasury, the most famous and iconic monument of Petra. You can also see the monastery, the theater, and the street of facades, or hike to the high place of sacrifice where you can see the panoramic views of the city and the mountains. Number 10. Venice, Italy, is a city and a lagoon built on a network of canals and islands in the northeastern part of Italy. It is one of the most romantic and enchanting cities in the world, with its bridges, palaces, and churches that reflect the artistic and architectural styles of the Byzantine, Gothic, and Renaissance periods. You can visit Venice by taking a train, a bus, or a car, and see the landmarks of the St. Mark's Square, the St. Mark's Basilica, and the Doge's Palace, 
or the museums and galleries of the Peggy Guggenheim Collection, the Chao Rosanico, and the Scuola Grande di San Rocco. You can also take a gondola, a water taxi, or evaporato and explore the canals, the islands, and the lagoon of Venice. Number 9. Serengeti National Park, Tanzania, is a wildlife reserve and a natural wonder located in the northern part of Tanzania. It is one of the most diverse and spectacular ecosystems in the world, with its savannas, woodland, and rivers that host millions of animals, including the Big Five, lion, leopard, elephant, rhino, and buffalo, and the Great Migration, wildebeest, zebra, and gazelle. You can visit Serengeti National Park by taking a plane, a car, or a bus, and enjoy the views, the wildlife, and the culture of the park. You can also take a safari, a balloon, or a camping trip and experience the adventure, the thrill, and the beauty of the park. Number 8. Stonehenge, United Kingdom, is a prehistoric monument and a mystery built by the Neolithic and Bronze Age people between the 30th and the 16th century BC in the county of Wiltshire, England. It is one of the most ancient and intriguing structures in the world, with its circular arrangement of large standing stones that have various astronomical and ritual meanings. You can visit Stonehenge by taking a train, a bus, or a car, and see the stones, the henge, and the surrounding landscape. You can also visit the visitor center, where you can see the exhibits, the models, and the artifacts of Stonehenge. Number 7. Mont Saint-Michel and its bay, France. And its bay is a rocky island and a tidal phenomenon, located in the region of Normandy, France. It is one of the most remarkable and impressive sites in the world, with its medieval abbey, village, and fortifications that rise above the sea and change with the tide. You can visit Mont Saint-Michel and its bay by taking a train, a bus, or a car, and see the abbey, the cloister, and the church, or the museums, shops, and restaurants of the village. You can also walk, bike, or horseback right around the bay and see the wildlife, the flora, and the views of the island. Number 6. Sagrada Familia, Spain. A basilica and a masterpiece designed by the Catalan architect Antoni Gaudí in the 19th and 20th century in the city of Barcelona, Spain. It is one of the most original and innovative buildings in the world with its organic and geometric shapes, colors, and symbols that express the Christian faith and the Catalan culture. You can visit Sagrada Familia by taking a metro, a bus, or a walk and see the exterior, the interior, and the towers of the basilica. You can also visit the museum. Number 5. Victoria Falls, Zambia, Zimbabwe, is a waterfall and a natural wonder formed by the Zambezi River on the border between Zambia and Zimbabwe. It is one of the most spectacular and powerful waterfalls in the world, with its width of over 1,700 meters and its height of over 100 meters that create a thunderous noise and a misty spray. You can visit Victoria Falls by taking a plane, a car, or a boat, and see the falls from the Zambia side, the Zimbabwe side, or the Devil's Pool, a natural pool at the edge of the falls. You can also take a helicopter, a microlight, or a bungee jump, and see the falls from above, or a raft, a kayak, or a cruise, and see the falls from below. Number 4. Easter Island, Chile, is a volcanic island and a cultural treasure located in the Pacific Ocean, about 3,700 kilometers off the coast of Chile. It is one of the most isolated and mysterious places in the world, with its moai, 
the giant stone statues that represent the ancestors and the deities of the Rapa Nui people, who inhabited the island from the 13th to the 16th century. You can visit Easter Island by taking a plane, a car, or a bike, and see the Moai, the Ahu, the platforms, and the Pukau, the top knots of the island. You can also visit the Rano Raraku, the quarry, where the Moai were carved, the Rano Kau, the Crater Lake, where the Birdman cult was practiced, and the Orongo, the ceremonial village, where the petroglyphs were engraved. Number 3. Hagia Sophia, Turkey, a museum and a monument, built by the Byzantine and Ottoman empires in the 6th and 15th century in the city of Istanbul, Turkey. It is one of the most magnificent and influential buildings in the world, with its dome, minarets, and mosaics that reflect the Christian and Islamic faiths and cultures. You can visit Hagia Sophia by taking a tram, a bus, or a walk, and see the exterior, the interior, and the galleries of the museum. You can also see the relics, the tombs, and the artworks of the museum, and learn about the history, the architecture, and the restoration of the building. Number two. Chichen Itza, Mexico, is an ancient city and a sacred site, built by the Maya and Toltec civilizations between the 6th and the 13th century in the state of Yucatan, Mexico. It is one of the most impressive and complex archaeological sites in the world, with its pyramids, temples, and observatories that demonstrate the astronomical and mathematical knowledge and skills of the ancient people. You can visit Chichen Itza by taking a bus, a car, or a tour, and see the landmarks of the El Castillo, the main pyramid, the Temple of the Warriors, and the El Caracol, the observatory. You can also see the cenotes, the natural wells, where the rituals and sacrifices were performed, and the ball court, where the game of life and death was played. Number one. Mount Fuji, Japan, is a volcano and a symbol located in the central part of Honshu, Japan. It is the highest and most iconic mountain in the country with its conical shape, snow-capped peak, and sacred status. You can visit Mount Fuji by taking a train, a bus, or a car, and see the mountain from the Fuji Five Lakes, the Hakon, or the Shizuoka. You can also climb the mountain, which is open from July to September, and see the sunrise, the crater, and the views of the mountain. You can also visit the shrines, the museums, and the festivals of the mountain, and appreciate the art, the culture, and the spirituality of the mountain. These are just some of the UNESCO World Heritage Sites that you can visit, but there are many more that await your discovery and appreciation. Each site has its own story, beauty, and significance, and offers a glimpse into the natural and cultural diversity and richness of our planet. Whether you are looking for adventure, inspiration, or education, there is a site that will match your interest and curiosity. So, what are you waiting for? Start planning your next trip and explore the wonders of the world's heritage. Thank you so much for tuning in. I hope you found this video enjoyable and informative. If you did, it would mean the world to me if you could show your support by giving it a thumbs up and hitting that subscribe button. Also, don't forget to check out the link to my latest video in the description below. By subscribing, become a valued member of our worldwide travel community, ensuring you won't miss out on any of the exciting experiences. Happy travels! Happy!